second term as a winner. Zin, so we have to commend him on that. Zin, big up Andrew Oldness. Your party happy, everybody supportive. Um, you're in your glory now, you're in your element. A lot of people are gonna ask me why me think the Jamaica Labour Party don't deserve the win. I can explain that to you later. But I can explain to you why People's National Party lose and lose so bad. And I can tell you why Jamaica Labour Party wins so massive. See? First things first. Internal disagreements and discrepancies within the party cause the People's National Party to lose the election. Zin, the People's National Party, Yamabas, has been having internal problems from as far back as PJ Patterson. Zin, um, Mr. Peter Phillips, as one who has always yearned for the top spot, him go at it with, with PJ, never work. PJ can be the best Prime Minister I've seen in my eyes up to now. Zin, PJ couldn't lose. No matter what him couldn't you lose. Zin, then, when it was handed over to Right Honorable Minister Portia Simpson as leader of the People's National Party, Peter never happy either. There was a whole comment about woman weak and woman can't run this and you know me I say and stylings and bag of thing. So Portia did come on to be a great leader too. She never dominate as much as how PJ Patterson did dominate. Zin. So it's like there was always internal feud. Now when the leadership was being handed over now, Zin, Bunting and Peter Phillips are go at it. The thing where Jamaica Labour Party do and win the nation is when their time to choose leader was presented. Remember you have Carl Samuda as Talwat um politician, you have Miss Babsy Grange, you have Desmond Mackenzie, you have a whole heap of people in the Labour Party where in an age them they weigh up them more than Andrew Wellness. Them claim to have more experience than Andrew Wellness. But the Jamaica Labour Party did not choose to ride that wave of who is older and who is more experienced. Them realize say, the nation had evolved and the, the age of the internet was up on us. So guess what them do now? Them just cut them ego and say, Andrew Wellness, you know, and him going to lead the thing. Remember some who could have rebel because he was one of the legends in the Labour Party. Remember Sir Babsy Grange could have worried and say, eh eh, and I'm a dead body. Them never do that. You understand what I'm saying? Them allow Andrew Oldness to lead. So that was the first spark of fire. We start the Jamaica Labour Party fire. Everybody was, oh, this is so refreshing. A new youth, a young youth, a young youth. Too much old man, too much. PNP never listened to the beckoning of the people. And the age thing. And the old style. You understand? That are the first thing. Cast the Jamaica Labour Party fire for start blaze. Second thing. Second thing. We and just start to win over the people. When we say win over the people, we win, win over everybody. Is when Andrew Olness take on the slang bro God. Every politician afraid to associate themselves with street level people. Afraid to associate the common man with them campaign. Now when Andrew got daddy one bro God and take it on as a slang, him get vandalized, him get backlash. But the new now generation never they abash him. Cause them feel like them and him connected. Cause them feel like blood clad. 
and you listen daddy one song that mean him listen cartel that mean him listen tj that, them just assume say him listen everybody well and might never hear a daddy one song at the time before but somebody around him tell him say yo daddy one have a bad song you know my was slang and him bro got it around the place you know boom the man got print t-shirt my bro got him do hot my bro got at a campaign in before campaign time when Andrew did that, me start fret. Because me as a PNP, no. See? So, from there, so, him start win the youth. Him start win the eyeglass, them on the corner. Him start win the man who have a stall. Because everybody in the street has said, Bro God, I feel that man has take on the Bro God slogan pan himself. Remember, say, it's not a church slogan him, say, him take on. You know? It's not a all it's slogan him take on. You know? And a miss low slogan him take on. You know? Him take on one of the youngest artists when they've reached now in the music yet. And take on the slogan there as the leader of the country. See? So, this are the people who start saying, No, that man is different. He's not really for the young, he's not for the new generation. Boom. He never, he never shone from it. When he's a rebel and a backlash, he never shone from it and say, Yo, I'm not mean, use broker, you know, I'm not mean, use broker because young people think of people. No, he run with it. When we look over my side, nobody now notice that Andrew do that. All I PNP them just today with them bureaucratic politics. Nope. Oh, my necktie and my this and oh, I don't go there and I don't go there. And we eat at this restaurant and we eat at that and bougie. So when you're not bougie, see people them yeah? here. I look over Andrew, what Andrew forward with next. See? Andrew go so. Remember you now? Andrew go so. When I talk about the thing them, why them shouldn't win it? You know? I tell you what, make them win. All right. Andrew comes so bam. Regular, some people up on social media. You see Andrew Wellness page comment. Really? The Prime Minister comment on somebody's page? What? In the on social media. We're going to go over Andrew's page. We're going to look what Andrew are dealing with. Even if I know Andrew angle the page, I Andrew people are sick as I Andrew Wellness certified page. This, I comment on people thing. You understand? So, check. Me never see Peter Phillips a comment on nothing yet. Me never even fit Peter Phillips have a social media page. Me, I, I, at one point, me never even know say Peter Phillips a lead People's National Party. One time we think of Lisa and I lead the party, although we know say Peter Phillips win as leader, but because he's not relevant, he's not in the social space, we don't know. Over PNP, something just boring. Over there, just boring. When we look for our timeline uh, in an explorer, we don't see nothing for PNP. But every day we can see bro God. Young girl, I say, whoa, they want bro God. They want to cheat on them man with bro God and it build a momentum bridging. No. This is how we blame People's National Party. You know, for them own loss. And for such a massive loss at that too. Because this is not a regular loss. You know. Not a regular loss. A big Big. We don't reach us a Turk, man. A big, big lose, we lose. No. How can the People's National Party have openly public figures who know so them are PNP and talk every day so them are PNP and want to involve them in our campaign? Oh, who no know so foot of hype a big PNP? Me are the biggest thing on social media. Oh no, incorporate me in on a campaign. Oh, when I hear me good, tell me if you not hear me. Oh, when I incorporate footer hype in on a campaign. Oh, footer not on social media. Uh, hold on, hold on. Hello? When I hear me now? When I hear me? Tell me if you not hear me. All right. Remember, say, Ricky Chopper is an openly vivid PNP. Big selector. Ono no a beanie man. Openly vivid PNP. Ono no incorporate we in the program. Ono no put out no money for campaign. Ono no book footer. Ono no book Chopper. Ono no book beanie man. Plus, only more PNP artists and influential figures within the, the entertainment. Uno see say, Andrew got social media buckle. So, what I got to do? Stay over there, sir. 
and left the man over here so for win by social media. Social media the biggest influence now, you know. So how oh, you have no relevance for social media at all? None at all. Lisa Anna alone, and then she lead the party. If it was Lisa Anna, who was leading the party at this time, Andrew in a trouble, you know. You understand what I say? So what I say is, that how we cause the PNP party to lose that election. Yeah. Next thing again, you have warfare. Whether it's not physical or literal or verbal, a warfare it name. It name warfare. Zin, boom. And you go so. Desert clocks. What I go say? Oh, and we're George Armani. The street no business about Jaji Armani. We no business about Steve Madden. We no care about none of that. Every ghetto youth have a desert class. Everybody knows the class of the inner thing. So I'll do Andrew. I'll do P.A. Fuckery. Him wear a desert class and run with that. All over social media, you see the damn foot so. And the man a dance and I do be a thing. The man knows that he a entertainment. I go win the election. I mean, entertain. Come, Peter Phillips advisors, one of them. If Andrew, we are a desert class, get the boss a bank robber. I saw you sitting set. If Andrew got desert, we are got bank robber. Care less about backlash. Uno never keep up with the fight. Uno act like it's a joke thing. You understand? The man got desert class, got bank robber. You make the man use PNP style and kill PNP. I no labor right bus desert clerks. A Spanglas bus desert clerks and mesh marina. A arrow shirt from back in the days. So how oh, you make the man use uno own style and kill uno. I wanna no come counteract that. I make them no say I want to a PNP thing you use. Go one side. Since you take a desert, see what wall I be here in your face. I'm level the playing field, Bridget. You understand what I say? Dog, it is embarrassing. And because you sit down like a sitting duck and not connect with the street. The street run everything. And the street decide who are the big artists. And the street decide who are the big selector. And the street decide who are the big politician. And the street decide all of that. So if you're not campaign through the street, you're going to lose. Nah, it makes no sense. Nobody in you know, your booji, bro. Oh, you might got desert clocks. That's so tacky. No, to pussy clock, get a bank robber or a wallaby and step out from them. I want to you. level the playing field. You know, see the man in my cellar. You know, see Christopher Tufton in a sex tape. Alleged sex tape. Who are bigger than that? With Batman business so rampant. And politicians are always being accused of being faggots. When Christopher Tufton near mix up in a brass clad cheating something. With a girl a blow off him thing. Allegedly. You know what that do? For Jamaica Labour Party campaign? These are the campaign that was happening. Where it's not a campaign. Listen you know. Them think they're a campaign. Which isn't a campaign. Because right through the four year. Where Andrew a run. Multiple things became relevant. That kept him on the brain of the people. So that's why I'm gonna call elections a sudden without any campaign time because him already a campaign. Christopher Tufton thing come make it worse. Me never even know who who in a PNP party. I me a big PNP. Me not see no campaign. Me not see no advertisement. Me not see no. We not no celebrity PNP MP more than Lisa Anna. And some people know bunt into. Some people. So on a player in yourself. This election was not won. <laughs> yeah, Vegas. That election here was not based on issues that affect the country. No. That election here wasn't based on nurses and doctors' wages. You know. This election was not based on teachers' pay. You know. This election was not based on public sector workers' pay. You know. This election was not based on 
the 12 o'clock lock off time that's happening in Jamaica. You know. All of that get forgotten. You know. All of that get forgotten. But at the clocks and the sex tape and the something them at the buzz. A labor right didn't have the buzz for real. Can't be a hypocrite. Although me is a dieted PNP. Labor right did have the buzz. Labor right did all over the news. It was a social media election. And that's why them go for the DJ, them for the dub plate. Them is not just them who do it. They don't like artists. Then I see him dance all them a fight. And I hate them is because of social media impact of work. It was all about the buzz. And a labor right of the buzz. So the PNP, first, too bureaucratic. Second, them not pay attention to the fucking street. Third, them not go for the street players, them with them up on them team. I don't know if I mean PNP mean. Or them not want to spend no money with Futter Hive. Or them not want to spend no money with Ricky Chupa. Or being him, I don't know. But they're not using the resources of the street. It was a street election. It was street via social media. And the PNP was not present on any of those levels. You understand what I say? Yeah, brother, you say, boss can't fix the country. But I am telling you what this election was about. It wasn't, nobody no member the implementations of the plans we put in for better nobody boy. None of the people them remember that. Brother. It was all about excitement and from the man come out in high clocks, going to parliament, nobody no member say, the man just say, dance, I feel like off now, and you're going back from curfew, and going to your house, and every selector hungry, and every artist hungry, and every style man hungry. Nobody no member that. Because of the frenzy at work. So when I say the People's National Party should have paid attention to what the streets are beckoning to. Zin? And go up on the same playing field and out the labor at them. They did not. The PNP was caught slipping, fighting amongst themselves. And now pay attention. Bunting wanna get out Peter. Peter wa have him ego to say I'm I'm last chance at it and he need the Prime Minister something. While him should have just low it. From Porsche time, I realize that the people are not into giving you the leadership in a Peter. But if the party win, everybody wins. It was a race for win for themselves between him and Bunting over winning for the team. It's a LeBron James thing going on. You know? Yeah, it's a LeBron James thing going on. Because Peter said, I'm last run this, and he won a shot at the leadership of the country. See? And Bunting, I said, them days, they're done. You understand me, I say? All Peter should have to fall back for the benefit fit of the party. It should have better you resign and on the winning team that resign losing and not winning the championship. It should have better you not be the star player, but your team win the championship and you resign. You understand me, I say? All right, Aisha, if we would have even lose, but we would have stand a better chance. I think, and this is for my comrades, my PNP people, Zin, I think it's time to give another female a chance. I think it's time to give Lisa another leadership of the party. I think it's time to give a female a chance again. Portia Simpson Miller, Miss Portia Simpson Miller, was the lady with the iron fist. Now, Lisa Anna to me is more charismatic and have a softer touch. Zin, remember Portia, I tell it like me. And just know, say, I wash she a deal it, she a deal it. And any boy ramp up. Pull it! Zin, so I think now. Nobody no need for a fight for the leadership. Let's fight for the win. Lisa, me say. No, but when I say Lisa barely regain her seat, but it's because of the entire team fucking up. The enough PNP in a vote. Listening to Labour winning and them win massive, you know. Because the PNP withdraw massive. 
because enough internal thing are going on. We split up the thing and some people before them vote Labour right, them rather don't vote at all. You understand? So whole heap of people not vote. Whole heap of PNP not vote. I tell me, I tell them. I me a PNP and me a telling them, stay them here and about a vote. If you watch it line them at the polling station and watch it colours, you know say whole heap of PNP not come out, bitch. Them have to reinstate Mr. Crawford too as a MP. Can you remember say Mr. Crawford is not in the political running now as a MP. You know. They need to reinstate him. Cause listen now. More than you have to follow suit, yeah, man. You see your labor right fall back and put the young man up front. And it will work for them. Two consecutive elections now. Zin? So PNP, one have to do it. One have to do Get rid of them old man there from the front line. Them can't manage. Them bent in them ways and them can't change. The fundamentals and foundation of the party now got change. But sometimes you have to depend on the team and know say and you I sell the team. You understand what I mean? So right now, big man thing. Lisa we say, you see me? Yeah, Lisa. Lisa. We say as the leader, right? Now, give back a woman a chance. You see me? Give back a woman a chance. I'm going to tell you now why. I don't think the Jamaica Labour Party deserve this winner. See? Based on what I'm going on. Based on the inflation, the dollar gone sky high. Based on my particular industry where me inner where me make money alpha where me survive i have not seen angel wellness for the four year i had where my prime minister given us any glory for the problem with the doctor them for the problem with the teacher them him not fix nothing all now the road them where my fix a job a pnp project where my finish up Zin, the cockpit country will sell out. People may not want to have short term memory now. Me want the labor right them come tell me what significant that Andrew has done to give him a landslide victory over Jamaica. I don't see it. I don't see it. The, the leniency we I get under Jamaica Labour Party government. I don't understand it. I don't know if there's a hidden agenda or what. All now, Andrew Wallace has not come explain to me the 200 odd million US or how much money he get from Bill Gates during this COVID pandemic here, where they might come with this vaccine and you go meet with Bill Gates and get money. And we don't know if we never see the picture, we wouldn't know. These are questions we need to be answered. You understand what I say? So, yes, Angie, you win. But I don't think you deserve that win. Because there are millions. The amount of places in West Milan when I have no water in 2020, you know, fulfill the needs of the people. Them. So, I don't understand this landslide victory. It's just because PNP is so fucked up within fighting themselves that's the people them just get Andrew you understand what I say we need fe, we need answers a whole heap of thing this ongoing what do I call it now hostage situation where JPS have the people them under Andrew you know address the JPS situation you all know JPS publicly come on news and say them a bad people bill you know, address that. You understand what I mean? Say? Jamaica Public Service and the Water Commission are the only entities that provide water and light. And they are rape the people, them pack it. They are extort the people, them. And Andrew has not yet dissolved that problem. So I am saying, I don't think JLP deserves the win. And that's just my honest opinion. There are too many issues affecting the country that has not been solved. 
you have not addressed these major issues and these issues matter to everybody not just jlp 